Oh. A lot of people are asking us on the blog, <laughs> YouTube videos, and Reddit. Okay. So, what's up, guys? Logan, let's talk to the people. Mm -hmm. No? Alright, well, I guess... <laughs> there we go. Um, so, day... Day 11. 11's my lucky number. Yay! So, yeah, day 11. Um, just a quick little prep update. Things are going really, really well right now. Just for reference, um, like I mentioned before, I forget how many weeks out I am from this photo shoot now. I think it's like eight. I think it's eight weeks out from the shoot. Um, but, uh, checking my weight this morning, I, I typically have gone on stage at, I'm five foot nine, I've gone on stage at 135. And this morning I was 138.5 and like I said, I'm like eight weeks out from this photo shoot. So that's a really good sign to me. Um, just kind of coasting in, haven't made any macro cuts in a few weeks, but I'm still losing on the last cut that we made. So I'm real happy about that. Oh my God, this dog is my life. I just looked over and he looks so cute. So we're going to lay with him. So yeah, things are going, no. No. Uh, things are going pretty good. There's my naked palette, my naked two palette. Um, things are going pretty good, and I'm about to get licked in the face. And I'm just really excited about it. I'm, I'm jazzed. I'm jazzed about life, y'all. So, don't really know what's going to go on today. Actually, I do. Um, so, a new Lululemon just opened in my city. Um, it's a bigger one, it's a better one, and I'm going to go Christmas shopping for Eric. And no, I'm not spoiling his gift because I'm pretty sure he doesn't watch these because he's a busy man and I tell him everything that I do anyway. Um, so, we're going to Lululemon, and I kind of already asked him, like, yo, how do you feel about Lululemon? Because he doesn't have anything, and I'm like, mm, this is not okay, we need to fix this, so I am going to introduce him. So yeah, we'll probably go there today, but first we gotta hit the gym, we got some legs, some glutes, and hammies, um, and yeah, I probably won't film it, but if I do, obviously you will see it. So, let's have some fun today. Let's have some fun, this beat is sick. I don't want to dig around on your disco stick because that's inappropriate. I'm quite unsure of what's going on right now and I really don't want to say this because I don't want to jinx it. So if I do jinx it, I really apologize. But it's December 11th and it's 50 degrees in the frigid north. So, bless. Oh, I can hear Logan barking. He hates when I leave. Oh, buddy. I see him in the window and he looks so, so, so sad. Oh, my boy. No. We're so, so dark. There he is. Where's Waldo? Where's Eric? There he is. Right. You guys always ask me what music I listen to while I work out and I have not been listening to this, but today we're gonna listen to Adele. Hopefully not too many feelings. All right, you guys, so just finished the cardios. And for those of you who have asked, a couple people have, where I got this snowman mug, the thrift store. Um, so yeah, just making my usual, usual cream of wheat and oat bran breakfast. And, Time for breakfast. Texting Corto, the teammate. Also, fun, exciting things. If you guys did not see my Instagram yet, um, the new PE Science Limited Edition flavor came out. Whoop. Came out today. It is white chocolate mint. Um, and you can use the code Emily now through Tuesday to get that tub, the 27 serving tub, for $20.99, which is hella cheap. Um, but that $20.99 price with my code only lasts until Tuesday, so make sure you hop on that. And it is a limited edition flavor, so once it's gone, like, it's gone, and you can't get it back. Um, so yeah. And just the typical breakfast, pumpkin, oat slash, well, pumpkin, oat, bran, slash cream of wheat with egg whites and cauliflower and coffee and snickerdoodle protein and bananas and good times. And there's my dad. Hi, dad. Look at you being so fit eating your vegetables. Wow. 
Hashtag Fitzbo. And then there's me over here with this giant bowl. And on the eighth day, the beauty gods created beanies because dry shampoo just won't work anymore. <laughs> Or baby powder, if you watched yesterday's video. Garbage person life. Keeps your hair healthier, right? 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 Oh my god, I'm like, gotta keep. Gotta keep the battery on go. Uh, and another chambray shirt. So we have 25 days of dog miss. Maybe these will be the 12 days of chambray shirts. Uh, so you see my dog every day, and then I would just wear chambray shirts all the freaking time. So these necklaces are from Vimondi. This shirt is Brandy Mel. This shirt is Brandy Melville. I got this shirt like years ago at PacSun when I was like 160 pounds. So now it's more like a boyfriend fit chambray shirt. Uh, the Mark bag, leggings, coincidentally from Lulu. Um, my dad's old socks that I stole and my little booties that I wear literally like every day that I'm obsessed with. There's literally a DJ. Hi. I was so excited about this. Okay. Thank you. No, I'm so excited. I went Kit and cats, we just finished up our little shopping adventure and I'm really hungry so I'm gonna eat before I get home. Keep my cookies in a Tupperware container because I'm not trying to have a broken cookie because like we talked about before, you don't eat cookies to be sad and if your cookie is broken then you will probably be sad. So I'm all about optimizing my cookie intake. Oh, there's people and I, like, I break my cookies when I eat them, I don't just eat it. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna eat my cookie, go home, and then I'll show you guys what I got. But I'm not gonna show you what I got Eric obviously because I'm not gonna spoil the surprise that much, just in case. Cookie! Mmm! Alright guys, so we're back from a little shopping adventure. Um, I'm gonna try and do, excuse me, like an unbagging as well as a try on because like I want you guys to see what this stuff looks like on in case you're interested in getting it yourself. Yay. Alright, so. Oh, okay. The second I put these on my body. Oh my god. So these are the Find Your Mantra Pant. Um, these are literally, okay, they're described as slim sweater pants. Oh my god, y'all. It's literally like a full body leg warmer pretty much. Um, so. You can see up close the fabric is ribbed. Um, so it literally, like, they really do feel like my old dancing warmers. Um, and the cool thing about these is they are a skinny fit, as you can see. And hopefully, when I do the try on, you can see it as well. They are a skinny fit, but you can unbutton the leg if you want it to be more like a flared sweatpant fit. They weren't baggy, they fit well, um, they're super soft. So I already have a ton of leggings from Lulu. Obviously you can never have too many, but I was like, yo, I wanna go with something a little different today. So these are gonna be good for like to and from the gym, lounging around the house, Christmas morning, <laughs> um, all of that good stuff. So the it says it's made with Bulux fabric, a blend of cashmere, tencel, and rayon from bamboo. So that's freaking awesome. And they are drawstrings, <clears throat> so you can adjust how tight they are. So those are the Find Your Mantra pants. If you follow me on Instagram, this is the shirt that I posted the selfie in. Uh, you guys really liked this shirt, so I will definitely try and show you on video what it looks like on. This is the And Go Everywhere tank. Um, 
So it's just like a gray heathered fabric. It's really cool because it's kind of crisscrossy in the back. Uh, when it's on, you'll be able to see that a little bit, a little bit better. But this was slightly fitted, but not skin tight. Um, it is the Luon, the light Luon fabric for sweat wicking and four way stretch. And I, I love gray. Like I love neutrals. That's literally all I buy. Closet building tip: when you buy all the same colors, everything matches. You think I'm kidding, but everything matches. So it was a really nice shirt that I got. Um, and again, I really like the kind of heathered gray color. Again, we're keeping it in the same color family. This is the Restless hoodie. So what I really liked about this, first of all, the print is really, really neat. Um, and it looks super cool on. Um, but what I really liked about this is I love hoodies, but I don't. And I do want to get one of the Lulu hoodies. I tried one on today. Um, so I might ask for one for Christmas. Um, but... What I really like about this is I don't always want to feel like a marshmallow in terms of hoodie wearing, so that's why I do like a lot of Lulu's jackets and things like this and such because they are fitted. And so you look a little bit more streamlined, a little bit more tailored, um, and that's what I personally like. I do like to look a little bit more streamlined as opposed to a bum. Sometimes I like to look like a bum, it just depends on the day. Depends on my mood, but more often than not, I don't want to look like a bum. So this is a little bit more fitted. Um, it has thumb holes, which is a big thing for me. Like, I freaking love thumb holes. It's got a hidden media pouch and cord guide and a kangaroo pocket to put your phone. I love <laughs> kangaroo pocket. I want a kangaroo. I asked my mom to bring me back a kangaroo from Australia, and she said no, and I was like, that's really rude. She wouldn't bring me a koala either, or whatever. Uh, yeah, this is the Restless hoodie. Um, I do wear size fours in all Lulu stuff. Um, some of the shirts, I will say, though, like the in the video that I did on the failure video, that running in the city tank, I did have to get a six in that shirt because it was really fitted in my lats specifically. Um, and some of the sports worlds I have to get sixes in as well. But as far as pants and the vast majority of shirts and jackets and sweaters and everything like that are four. Um, so those are the sizing. That is the sizing info. So yeah, that is my little Lulu haul for today. And I did stop in at Forever 21, um, just because I want, I was looking for scarves, and then I've also been on the hunt for a gray turtleneck sweater. So I I really like turtlenecks, like they're classic, um, but I wanted a fitted, fitted gray turtleneck sweater, just because again, it's a little bit more streamlined. Um, so this uh, is the turtleneck that I got from Forever 21. This is a small and it was like $22. Uh, it's pretty soft, like sometimes I find the Forever 21's fabrics are just not comfortable um, and so I don't really shop there a lot. Uh, this one wasn't scratchy at all, it fit pretty well. Uh, you could see my delts through it, which was nice. <laughs> but yeah, so this will be great under like a leather jacket or on, or on its own, you know, whatever. Tucked into some black jeans, tucked into some high-waisted jeans, all that good stuff. And then this is the scarf that I got. Um, I'm fairly sure that Robin has this scarf, which is ironic because like I said before, I'm obsessed with her and maybe this means we're like spiritually connected now. Robin, are we? All right, but yeah, I just really got a scarf so I could hide in it. Um, but no, just kidding. This scarf is huge and majestic and I will not buy a scarf if it does not engulf at least 60% of my upper body and that one passed the test. So, um, that has been my little Lulu and Forever 21 mini haul. Um, someone asked me to do like a, a lookbook, like a Lulu lookbook, so maybe I'll do that in a future Vlogmas video. Catch you guys on Vlogmas Day 12 is tomorrow. So that'll be that for today. I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions about uh, Lulu stuff or you would like to see a Lulu lookbook video, um, like this video, give it a thumbs up, leave a comment below and all of that good stuff. Uh, make sure you guys are hitting the thumbs up button if you like a video uh, because that does help me, you know, see physically what kind of content you guys like. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, make sure you do that and I'll see you tomorrow. Love you. Bye.